Today I will talk about sustainable supermarkets and how some have become more environment, environmentally friendly. Many of the major supermarket chains have come under fire with accusations of several unethical acts over the past decade. Having um, some supermarkets have um, a lot of supermarkets have wasted tons of food. Um, they have underpaid suppliers contributed to excessive plastic waste in the packaging, which had a great impact on the environment. However supermarkets and grocers are starting to sit up and take notice. There are rising consumer backlash against huge amounts of plastic waste created by packaging. Some largest um, UK supermarket signed up to a pack promising to transform packaging and cut plastic wastage. Supermarkets pledge to reuse, recycle, or compost all plastic waste by 2025. Um, they are beginning to take responsibility for what they have damaged to the environment. Um, so there are one major supermarket that announced their plan to eliminate all plastic packaging in their own brand products by 2023. Um, so, facing criticisms over food waste, some supermarkets are donating uh, several of their food surplus, but charities estimate only that they are only assessing 2% of supermarkets total food waste so this hardly seems to be solving the problem some say that supermarkets aren't doing enough and most supermarkets operate under a veil of secrecy when asked for exact figures of food wastage. Um, it is hard to come up with a systematic approach to avoiding waste and to redistributing surplus food. Some smaller companies are now taking matters into their own hands and offering consumers a more environmentally friendly options. Some shops such as Berlin's Original Unverpack and London's Book Market are plastic-free shops that have opened in recent years. They are encouraging customers to use own containers or compostable bags. Also, um, a online grocer farm job eliminates the need for large warehouses and the risk of huge food waste by delivering fresh produce from local farmers to customers every day via electric cars. Offering ha farmers the lion's share of the retail price. There's no doubt that we still have a long way to go in reducing food waste and plastic waste, but maybe supermarkets might take inspiration from these smaller gro grocers and gradually move towards to a more sustainable future for all.